So I'm in Atlanta, got off the plane, got off the train, now I'm waiting for my friend to pick me up. And I guess I really haven't explained what I'm doing in Atlanta. Basically, you guys, the time finally came and I bought a bus. Not a van, like originally planned. Wow, I'm just rhyming right now. But a bus, a short school bus, and I'm really excited about it. I'm ecstatic. <sighs> Good morning, everyone. It's about 9.30 a.m. on Tuesday. I'm waiting because um, I need a ride to be able to go look at the bus. So I have to wait until my friend that I'm staying with gets off work and then we're gonna go. Uh, so it's crazy. Like I seriously, I don't know, it, it still hasn't registered. I don't think it's gonna register until I'm like there handing him the money. Uh, so for now, I'm slowly learning how to juggle. Oh my god, we need something to hold you up. So, I was just sitting here, chilling, enjoying the sunshine, and listening to some music, and I got a phone call, and I was like, Ugh, come on, like, you're killing my vibe, who is this, what, what do they want? And it was actually the college that I have applied to. And she's like, oh, okay, yeah, so your advisor uh, was reaching out to you, but he just left the office, so you have been accepted into our program. And I was like, what? Wait, what? And she was like, yeah, you didn't know that you were accepted into our program, right? And I was like, well, I didn't, but now I do. So I'm going to college. <laughs> Online. <clears throat> Online, but I'm still going to college, and... Yeah, that was so wild. That was so wild. So many things are happening today. Oh my God. I have so much stuff hanging off the side of me. <sighs> I have no idea where I'm going. Apparently this park is like massive. So I'm just like walking. Thankfully I don't have a car so I don't have to like go back to the car. So if I end up on the other side of town, just lift back, it's fine. I stumbled upon a dog park. Spooky. Okay, rolling. Is this like rolling? <laughs> okay, so that was wild. It was super crazy in there. Um, but I got an apple because I, I got hungry. And. I got some face wash and some uh, argan oil because I ran out and I packed an empty face wash container to come here. Like how stupid is that? Good morning everyone. It's almost 11 o'clock. I'm about to go get some breakfast, but first I want to show you something that happened last night. Um, I got a school bus. <laughs> I can't stop smiling. This is so amazing. <laughs> I've been working really, 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 really hard to get to this point. And I've been, and I've been talking about this conversion for months and months and months. And it's something that I've wanted to do for years. <sighs> and I'm finally doing it. And it feels really good. The fact that I paid for it all myself, um, I got myself here, I made this happen. There's still a long ways to go, there's still a lot of work to do, and there's gonna be times where I do want to give up. But I feel so 
right in this position. It, it definitely feels right. Oh my gosh, what a crazy day. I set out to leave Atlanta at 11 o'clock and I ended up leaving at like 1.30 because the battery in the bus died on me. And thankfully I have AAA right now. They came and replaced the battery. <sighs> and then I drove about two hours, got some gas. The car started up, the car. The bus started up fine, and then I drove another two hours, had to fill up again. I stopped at this like truck stop, uh, filled up my tank because it was cheaper, and the bus wouldn't start up again. So my brand new battery was not working anymore. Um, so I started to freak out a little bit, um, but tried to keep my cool. Oh, I'm getting a call. Hello everyone. It is the last stretch of the trip home with the bus. Um, I checked in with you guys last night and then I got a phone call and then I started driving while I was on the phone. So, um, I didn't finish telling you what was up. Um, so I don't remember exactly what I said in that video, but essentially um, my battery died in the morning. I got it replaced and then my bus wouldn't start again so we had to assess the problem um some beautiful people ended up helping me at the gas station it was amazing and um but then it was so late I decided to stay in Hillsboro for the night with my family and now I'm heading home so it's just about a three and a half four hour drive back to the beach if you want to see more content uh of the bus conversion and of my life living in the bus, then definitely check out my Patreon. I will have that linked below, as well as all of my social media handles if you want to just check out a little bit more of my life. If you enjoyed this video, remember to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and subscribe to this channel. Hit the notification bell to make sure that you never miss an upload, and I will see you guys next time. Ha, huh, you thought this video was over. And so did I. Um, so yeah, bus won't start again. <sighs> Starting to think that it actually is the alternator that is the problem and not the battery. Um, it's brand new battery and everything is tight and connected on it. So we're just gonna try and jump start it and hopefully that'll work. Not stoked about that. <laughs> so, I always said that I wanted to be 100% real with you guys and show you the good, the bad, the sad, the ugly, all of it. Well, I'm in one of those situations now where just you know um a bit of a struggle as as you know the bus battery was having issues um at the moment it's starting and st it's stopping and starting fine so they jump started the, the the bus and i was on my way home when i started to get a very severe pain in my abdomen and it's still happening right now. That's why I'm struggling. I'm pretty sure that it's an ovarian cyst, of course. Um, I can't be completely sure, but um, based off of what it feels like, where it is, and just some of the, the medical things that I've had going on, um, in the past year or so that's what would make sense it's not um it's the pain is mainly on my left side so it's not um appendicitis 
<sighs> but it's really it's really intense. <laughs> um, I just need to like take care of myself and figure out what's going on and drive home and focus on being safe and um It's Friday right now. It's about 5:30. And I was planning on having this uploaded tomorrow, um but I don't know I, don't, I mean, I don't know how that's possible, how that's going to happen, because I don't have my laptop with me. So, this is the real end to the video. <laughs> but, um, I want you guys to know that I'm going to be okay. But the pain is definitely better now than it was. Talk to you guys later. <laughs> Hopefully all this will be sorted out. Peace.